What's up y'all, it's Veronica, AKA She Melanated, and I'm back with another video. Today is Monday the 14th, and I'm due on a 19th, but I'm being induced today. So, it is 6.28, I'm supposed to be at the hospital at around eight. Um, so I'm just making sure that everything is packed to make sure I have everything, making sure I put something in my stomach. I'm eating on a bagel right now. <clears throat> I was just on the phone with my mom. She's on her way to work. She just wished me well because, you know, only one person could be in the hospital and my boyfriend's going to be in the hospital with me. So everybody's wishing me well. I just can't wait until I get to hold my baby girl. Like that's all I've been hoping for that's all I've been waiting for is just to be able to hold my baby and know that all the pain and everything that I've been through for these last nine months was worth it because I feel like I've been pregnant for so long oh for like the whole entire year so I'm ready to have my baby girl but most definitely ready to get my body back <laughs> get my taste buds back all this heartburn could go away oh lord I'm just ready I will keep y'all updated as soon as I get in the hospital and I'll let y'all know what's going on. Peace. Okay, everybody, we just arrived at the hospital. Yeah. It is 8.02 a.m. Hold on a second. So like I said, me and babe just got in the hospital. Say hi. And I'm about to show y'all how the baby will be. Oh, I can't wait. This is where I will be. Babe sleeping on that skimpy couch. I told him to bring a pillow and a cover. He didn't listen, so. This is our sink. The mirror. This is where people come in. This is the bathroom. TV. And that's it. So, update you guys. I got a COVID test earlier. It came negative, of course. They just put saline in me. Got my IV in. I'm watching a movie now and I'm eating lunch. It is 11.57, 12 o'clock in the afternoon. I'm hooked to my monitors right now. Baby's heartbeat is very consistent, so that's good. They gave me my first miso, my first miso pill to start softening my contraction. I mean, start softening my cervix. They're gonna monitor me for every two hours and give me another miso to soften my cervix. And then they're gonna give me a pill to open my cervix and start contractions. So I will keep you guys updated. Just a little update for you guys. It is now 3 p.m. Me and Bay just been watching a movie and I've been trying to sleep a little bit. They only gave me month they only gave me one miso and I was earlier at like 10. My midwife told me that I need to stay hydrated before they give me a second one. And they said I've been having contractions, but I haven't been feeling them. So I guess they'll get harder and they'll be more painful later on. But yes, baby girl is doing good. Heart weight is at 130 right now. And I'm guessing yeah. this is her heartbeat. And these have been my contractions, but I haven't been feeling them. So. So it's me and Bay right now. We are just walking through the hospital, as you can see. Um, right now, she's having some contractions. Um, they're getting longer and more intense, so that means the baby's getting closer to being here. So right now, me and Veronica, we're just walking around. We're kind of being okay, nosy. We too far down. No, nah, it's okay. We're kind of being nosy. We're just walking around, looking at other rooms, kind of comparing them to our room to see how they, you know, ante up to our room. This, this one. one. That's, the one. That's the one I'm talking about. <laughs> She's just walking around. Just we walk. hit a wall. Did we, um, were we no, no, supposed, no, we're supposed to... to turn that way? Yeah. It's okay, though. We're just walking around, just getting some exercise in and... <laughs> We'll just keep everybody posted and updated. Ah!